everyone! Uh, welcome to Ann Makes and today I have the second part of a big Dollarama haul that turned out to be taking me longer to film than expected. I didn't realize how big my haul was. So if you uh, didn't see the first part, I'll provide a link for you to go check that out if you'd like to see it. And uh, and if you'd like to see how I use a lot of the things I haul in uh, these hauls, please check out my blog at annmakes.blogspot.com where I show a lot of craft projects, DIYs, and how-tos. And I usually list all the materials I used for my projects there. And uh, so are you ready to see the second part of my big Dollarama haul? Because <laughs> here it is. Another item I picked up for Thanksgiving and fall decorating and crafting is this bag of 150 pieces and it says they're for Thanksgiving. These little like silky maple leaves and I, they're very pretty and a bag of like this is $1.25. I just think the colors are very pretty. I love how small they are here but I picked up just one of each. These are the Jolie's Boutique uh, parcel uh, dimensional stickers with glitter and also had the spider webs with the little spiders. They're just really beautiful uh, stickers. I don't remember the price of these offhand. Of course they're not tagged but that doesn't mean they were a dollar. They could have been a dollar but they could have been much they could have been a bit more and if I can find the receipt, I will try to include the price on the screen. Another new item for me are, this is new for me this year. I don't remember seeing this last year. Uh, these are the Halloween wood clips. Uh, there's three in here and they have them in kitty cats. They had other motifs, I believe, but I love cats, as you may already know. So I got these ones. These are $1.50. Of course, I got some stickers because it's really hard not to. Um, I got this sheet of Halloween stickers with Google Eyes because of the cute kitty cats on it. Of course, I can't resist kitty cats. And this is a dollar twenty-five. They're like the vinyl ones. They're very cute. And I got this little package of Sandy Lion 104 stickers for Halloween. Again, I'm not sure if this was a dollar. If it if it wasn't, I'll put the price on the screen. I picked up three. I picked up three of the photo magnet sheets. These are six by nine, I believe. Yes, they are six by nine. They go for $1.25 each. I use these mostly for uh, organizing and storing my metal dies. I got also these wall stickers. These are quite dimensional, they're like a plastic. And of course I got these because of the kitty cats. And this set, there are six pretty big stickers here. They call them wall stickers. Uh, they are $1.50. I got this set of stickers with album uh, with the goofy looking cat on it. So this is like a little sticker album and I I really liked all the silly kitties on there and jack-o'-lanterns, so I'm sure this will be cute in my planner and in some other crafts, and you get all this for $1.25. I got these Glimmer Sketch Kits for Halloween. There are eight pieces in here for $1.50, and these are the things, you know, if you remember, they show the little picture here, and on the back, you can see you scratch away the black stuff and there's like color underneath it and it comes with uh, pumpkin spiders and cats uh, so I thought these might be cute in some sort of craft project card decoration pocket letter you name it so, and I thought it's pretty good value because you get eight for a dollar 25 I've seen many of you out there haul these I hauled some last year I have used these as decorations in the past and I'm hoping to use these again this year for a uh, decoration as well as a craft project. Uh, they are really spooky <laughs> characters. They're, they're a hoop for all of this, which I think is an excellent deal. And they look pretty good. These boutique 
these little silky flowers, dimensional flowers, and I they look, it's hard to tell if they are a really dark brown or a black, but I thought these are perfect for decorating in a like a Halloween album, mini book type of thing. So I might use them for that or to decorate on a frame too. There's just all so many things that can be done with these. And these are these only are a dollar that I remember. So I think that's a that's a heck of a good deal. The temporary tattoos, because I use these in my paper crafting. Uh, and they are a dollar fifty for each. And these are the ones I chose, and they have so many different ones. Um, but these are the ones that spoke to me the most for my crafting. I knew there was another one. And of course I got this one because there was a cat on it. <laughs> for the four. And I just think these are really pretty. I mean, imagine if you do put a little LED candle in here and it lights up at night. What a pretty decoration. And for $2, I think that's really that's really a good deal. These sticko Halloween stickers with uh, spider with the spider webs. You can see that, okay? Spider webs and spiders and boo and so creepy. Ooh, eek. And I believe these were a dollar. This is not Halloween, and this was the only one there on the on the rack. And I thought, oh, these are very cute. So I. I took it. Um, I wish they had some more. These are Kate and Company uh, sticky notes, and I just think they're really pretty. They have nothing to do with Halloween, but um, yeah, I couldn't pass these up. I picked up another package of these label stickers for Halloween, mostly because there's a lot of black cats on there, and I like to use this in all my paper crafting for this time of year. And this whole sheet, and there's 24 stickers on here, is a dollar twenty-five. I picked up some more of these little bags just for um, that book that I have in mind to make for Halloween, and I thought these would be perfect for for that time because of the black. So the black and white polka dots and the black and white stripes. You get ten bags in here. They're each a dollar twenty-five. The dollar one of the dollaramas I went to had a lot of these. They had them in uh, blue, red, and I think there was also purple if I remember correctly, and black and white. And I liked this uh, package of five Halloween masks. So basically, color your own Halloween masks on a stick. They're um, a pretty thick chipboard. They are a dollar twenty-five. Uh, I probably will take the sticks off of these and just use these. I thought if you if you color these and decorate them and you put them in front of a a candle, maybe not a real candle, uh, but a, some a lot with light behind it, they make a, for a nice decoration that Halloween. And look, there's even one of these um, Day of the Dead or Sugar Skull ones right there which is kind of fun so I just thought for a dollar 25 that's pretty good because you get it you get a sturdy base that's already cut for you I bought one of these see it's a kitty it's a mask it's a wooden mask and I think it's really nice it is only a dollar 25 which I think is a very good deal and the Dollarama I went to had the had these as a cat. They also had um, oh they had other characters, uh, bats, ghosts. So oh I can't remember how many there were, but I wanted the cat one of course. And I just think this is really really awesome. I just imagine this with some lights behind it. It might look really cool. And I might go back and get a few more in case I get some other decorating ideas for this. So, but it, it does make an excellent um, mask that you have to carry around. But I got two of these felt placemats 
or felt decorations or whatever. I picked up this one because if you can tell, see, they are cats. They're purple though. I would have liked if to have found a black one, but I took the purple. I'm not sure what I will do with this, if I will use it as is or if I'll cut up the cats or maybe I'll cover a, like a, a binder with these. I, I'm not sure what I'll do with them, but I just had to get them. I hauled one with these orange leaves. I've hauled others like this uh, in the past for the leaves themselves because I think they're really pretty, but I just picked up another one because I, I thought this was a good orange that would complement the purple well. And these are $1.50 each, and they're just really, really nice. They could be placemats, they could be uh, table centers, they could be anything. You can cut these up also if you want, so you get a lot of product for. I caved in and bought one bowl of bolt, or that's not what you call this, uh, one of these things of yarn, so super chunky yarn fell. This is not real wool, it's acrylic, uh, that's okay. And I'm, I'm not really looking to do the arm knitting because this is what the intention is to sell, that these are sold for, for people who wanna do arm knitting. And I thought this would make great snow or snow banks in our Christmas village or in a fairy garden too, because it, it's already like rolled up, but it does open up a bit. So um, just thinking of the, other crafting possibilities for winter and Christmas decorating and so you get this thing of yarn for four dollars. Purchase the kitty cat cookie cutter by Wilton. I'm pretty sure I purchased one of these last year and it is in my box of cookie cutters in the kitchen and I just thought I would get another one in case I can't find it but also because I thought this is this one's going in my craft supplies uh, to be used as a shape and to be used as a mold for cutting dough uh, cutting them um, clay and whatever I want to cut with it I found these funny they sell these as hair clips they're like skeleton hands and they um, so I got one in the purple and one in the black. These are $1.25. And I just thought they, they make really cute clips. I'm not sure I will wear these in my hair that much, but I just thought, you know, you could put these on the edge of a bowl at Halloween or on a pocket letter or... <laughs> I just think it's fun. It's a fun little thing to use as a decoration not just as a hair accessory so I got those I never seen this at my Dollarama before but these are from Martha Stewart crafts it is a set of acrylic stamps clear stamps with uh, for a birthday a birthday theme set of clear acrylic stamps um, what a good deal this is a dollar fifty for this set I stopped at the vet. That's where I went to. I went out uh, to the Dollaramas because I stopped at the veterinarians to get Kitty Cat. She's right there. Her food and they had these uh, stickers, Love Pet Trust .ca. So they're a decal. I can't really show you what it looks like, but you stick this in your window of the door or window in front of your house uh, to tell the first responders. Um, in case you know in case you're not home or something your house is on fire or whatever that there is a pet inside your home uh, so if they can you know if it's safe enough for for them to retrieve your pet you know at least they know there's a pet inside and they can try to save your pet if you're not home some more Halloween things that I found one is this make your own 3d foam kit Halloween mansion for three dollars and fifty cents and I chose this model the little haunted house with the little witches and the kitty thought it was really really cute this is cute to uh, for kids to make and it's also something that is fun to make and to add to our Halloween village or garden and I also got this kit that is three dollars and it is it's this foam activity kit, but it's actually a banner, a chipboard. These are all chipboard, 
and all the stuff is inside to make it. And of course, um, you don't have to make uh, this banner if you don't want to. You could just use the supplies inside for other uh, crafty things and DIYs, even to decorate pocket letters. And Oh, there's so many things you can do with this. I purchased another one of these Lori Collapsible Cosmetic Bags. Uh, these are $3.50. Fifty cents. I use these to store, organize, and transport many of my art and crafting supplies. I love to use these for that. They are just a great size. They keep my uh, pencil crayons, my drawing pencils, even some paintbrushes safe while I travel. There's multiple compartments. I just. Uh, love it for that. I have something similar for when I do or for my own my own health and beauty products when I travel but these ones I buy specifically for my um, crafting tools and supplies. One of these vinyl placemats these are $1.25 and they do have a texture to them and I want to try to see if I can cut this and maybe make covers for like my happy planner. I saw these adorable removable window stickers for Halloween and objects and I just think the images are wonderful for that. Now the one dollar I went to had a lot of these rolls of tinsel ribbon but they're really big rolls. Uh, these are three dollars a piece and you get over 70 feet of this plasticky tinsel here um, on a roll and they come in this orange which I bought one of the purple which is kind of shiny and the green shiny one and this black one so I got two of the black because I thought I could use this in different projects throughout the year and I even thought the green could be used also at Christmas but and the orange and purple most likely for Halloween, but I thought uh, there's probably going to be multiple crafting uses for these. And they're really, like I said, they're really big rolls. They should get over 70 feet in here for $3. This one. And I've seen YouTubers haul this months ago, but it just showed up in my dollar store, my Dollarama. It is the pack of DC uh, by 12, the scrapbook paper size. But uh, a lot of, there's linen and paper. So this one's linen and yeah. <laughs> so uh, yeah I got this they're, they're small boxes but they're very handy I so each of the four boxer boxes measures 10 by 12 by 15 to give you um, an idea of the size there's blue and gray in here and uh, since we are still cleaning and organizing and always cleaning and organizing and purging. Um, I thought these would be handy for storing a lot of papers, you know, all those papers that you have in house that you keep for so many other reasons, tax purposes, blah, blah, blah. So, uh, yeah, got this. And finally, that is it. That is that for my huge Dollarama haul that uh, turned out to take longer to uh, film than I had anticipated. If you have hung in here for all this time, thank you so, so very much for doing so. I hope that you uh, liked this video, and if you did, I would so appreciate a thumbs up. I appreciate a like, a comment, a share, and uh, subscribe if you're not already subscribed, because uh, it's a lot of fun to see uh, more people join. And uh, until next time, please take care of yourself, and I'll see you after my next haul. Bye!